For more than three months, over 200 million gallons of oil spewed into the Gulf of Mexico, a mile underwater as the world watched images of billowing oil on live television 24-7, rendering us helpless witnesses. The leak has stopped, but the tragedy of the largest man-made ocean catastrophe outside war continues. Government estimates claim that three quarters of the oil is gone and the worst is over. Many people and some scientists think the worst is about to begin as the consequences of the living system are revealed. Jean-Michel Cousteau and his Ocean Future Society team were among the first on site to dive the oil-stained Gulf waters and to confirm the movement underwater of oil mixed with dispersants. They were among the first to meet with parish presidents, working around the clock to get answers from BP and the Coast Guard. They saw the first oil ooze on shore. The team recorded the faces of this early event. The fishermen, pelicans, dolphins, crabs, turtles, shop owners, and the blackened marshes and beaches. But what is the bigger picture? Where is their hope and how soon? Where have these massive amounts of oil and dispersants gone? And most importantly, what have we learned? In a proposed hour-long special program, Jean-Michel Cousteau and his team will investigate the wildlife, the people, the politics, and the region's industries to answer the questions that we all want to know. Following this special program, Jean-Michel Cousteau will present monthly investigative reports on the status of the Gulf. The broken well has stopped spilling, but we need to monitor the region to ensure that all is being done to aid in its recovery. Join Jean-Michel Cousteau and his team as they investigate the Gulf.